So one of my old subscribers has sent me in this lovely 10 questions about what would happen if I grew to be 30,000 feet tall. So I'm going to answer the questions now because I never got around to doing it with my old channel. Um, if you suddenly grew to be 30,000 feet tall, explain how you might accidentally step on some people and what they'd last see when they looked up and how they notice how you'd notice you stepped on them. Um, I would probably accidentally step on people. That is my explanation. Um, what they'd last see when they looked up was either my foot or my jeans. Um, up my jeans. And how I'd notice I stepped on them. I don't know. Probably the noise of them screaming as they got squished. Um, what people would you purposely want to step on? And how would you step on them with your giant bare foot? I wouldn't purposely step on anybody. I'm not that mean. Um, would you stomp on them completely flat into your giant footprint? Or grind them into your sole of your giant bare foot? I think that I should wear I wear socks more than I do barefoot, so this doesn't really count for my feet anymore. Um, I'd stomp them completely flat because I think that'd be quite interesting to be a flat person. Um, yeah. Would you leave giant footprints everywhere and why? What would be smushed inside those footprints and why? I would make giant footprints. I don't know why, I just wouldn't want to make giant footprints and nothing would be really squishing to my giant footprints unless I stepped on something. Um, what part of your foot would you squash them under and why? Explain how the, what would be fun about stepping on them with your bare foot. Um, I would squash them under the bit between, between my toes. I don't know why. Um, and nothing's fun about squishing people with your giant bare foot. That's not nice. How many people would you get into one stomp? Explain what type of bug they remind you of stepping on and how you step on that type of bug. Um, I'd probably be able to get five people under my foot. I just That's just a random guess. I'm not quite sure. And they remind me of stepping on snails because you'd be able to hear the crunch. Um, would your giant bare foot cover their entire puny bodies and why? Also, would you high or low stomp them and why? Someone has lost it. Um, I would... Yes, their giant puny bodies would be covered by my big foot. Um, and I would low stomp them. I'm just randomly guessing now. When would you say this? I'm going to step on you with my giant bare foot and squash you like a bug into the sole of my bare foot and squish you completely flat. Never. Also explain how you'd step on me with your giant bare foot if you were really mad at me and what part of my your foot I'd stick to and why. Um, I don't actually know. And no, I can't even answer that one. Also demonstrate how you'd step on those tiny enemies. I'm going to show you. Raw. Quick apologies to all the normal people who are now thinking, what have I just spent about three minutes watching? Um, I promise some normal vlog will come to you tomorrow. Just had to get that one done and out of the way. Bye. I'd just like to quickly add that we we're in um, town today, shopping, and I found this. So I bought one. I'm so happy. I'm now the proud owner of one of the Mario mushrooms. They have green ones in there too, so I'll be going to buy one of those soon, hopefully.